In the depths of the Ice Age, when mammoths wandered and saber-tooths hunted the fields, another predator existed, equally fierce and equally legendary. Introducing the dire wolf, bigger, bulkier, and stronger than any modern wolf. Initially identified in the 1800s, the dire wolf, Canis dirus, stood as one of the leading predators in North America more than 10,000 years ago. Reaching almost three feet in height at the shoulder and weighing as much as 150 pounds, it wasn't merely a legend. It was an actual creature. In contrast to contemporary wolves, dire wolves possessed a sturdier physique, a more powerful bite, and teeth designed for pulverizing bone. They hunted in groups, taking down large animals such as bison and even juvenile mammoths. Yet in what ways were they unlike today's gray wolves? Researchers claim a fair amount. DNA research indicates that dire wolves were not direct predecessors of gray wolves in any way. In reality, they diverged millions of years in the past. More like a cousin than a sibling. Approximately 10,000 years ago, the Ice Age came to a close. The climate has shifted. The prey disappeared. One by one, the dire wolves vanished their remains eternally ensnared in locations such as the La Brea Tar Pits. Although extinct, the dire wolf continues to echo in our minds. A representation of strength, enigma, and disappearance.